Hi guys, I'm Ashley and I am currently sitting in the special tomato, special needs jogger stroller and I'm going to show you um, what my stroller has and why I use it and my mom is videoing me. I am completely blind so she's like my video woman right now um, and she pushes me a lot. So anyway, I'm going to show you guys what I know about it and why I use it and what you can use yours for but this is me. Okay, so I'm able to get out of it. I'm able to walk. Um, I am 33 years old and I do have a um, heart condition called Tetralogy of Fallot. And so I am actually a little person, a legit little person. I think they call those LPs. And um, I weigh 72 pounds and I have spastic quadriplegic cerebral palsy on the moderate side. Um, I'm also completely blind. I have retinopathy of prematurity. I was born about a month early and um, hmm, not missing anything, mom. I wear hearing aids. Um, and so basically I am an adult in a child sized body. Um, so we use the special needs stroller for long distances and for walks. And especially in the summertime, the orthopedic doctor thought it was a good idea. Oh, because I do have epilepsy and I have seizures. So which brings us to this, and I will end this video out with me sitting in it again, just to show you some things. So this comes with a canopy. Um, I don't know all the, the like inches and stuff that they tell you online. You can look it up. It's a special, they only have this in one size. Um, <coughs> special <laughs> tomato jogger, right? Yeah, special tomato jogger. They do have like the EIO stroller and we've used that before, but you will need to measure to make sure you fit. Um, I literally um, reached the deadline of fitting and the next stroller up was going to be like for like bigger people and there was no sense of getting something bigger. So um, we are using the, if you can show them, so under this padding, we do have this padding, we do have the um, lilac color um, liners. And the reason that we use the liners is not because I am not stable enough in the stroller, it's because my legs have a really hard time going flat. And so when I have that extra boost, um, it does make it easier to balance and my legs are a little flatter in this part, which is you really You wanna cool. hold it up so they can see what it looks so like. So this is what it looks like. Now I don't- turn it, Can you do it, turn it sideways? And, yeah. Okay, okay, and then this way. Perfect. Now I don't have, um, <coughs> sorry y'all, I'm getting through cold. And it goes right in the stroller. This is the size two. The size one and size two fit in this type stroller. I don't use the buckles to it. It does come with harness and buckles. I don't need the buckles. I um, just need the stroller itself. If we are going like on a very long day and like, for example, we may need a buckle. The only the, buckle that I have used before is just like the- Like in the mountains or something? Yeah, like if there's something where, you know, I will use- Hills. This, what do you call it? The, the, Hills. Yeah, but what kind of buckle would this be? It's like, it's like it buckles in your legs and your bottom part. Not your, I don't need the harness, I don't need any of the shoulder straps. We do have them on the stroller, but I just don't need them. But if we are going somewhere far, I will use these buckles for safety. Just like for your waist, kind of. Yeah, for your waist, basically. For your lower, which, yeah. Which, in my wheelchair, your legs, I do your have hips. a wheelchair, um, I, I will use the buckle for that. So that kind of makes sense. But what we like to do is I like to put the padding over this because it makes it really a lot more cushiony and comfortable and I will show y'all I do have this pillow for the back um so that when I lean back this stroller right now is reclined all the way back it can go up um but um my doctor wanted it for my back so we we don't really move it up because it's I have a wheelchair for that reason um so basically um if you want to show them the wheels it comes with the jogger stroller and the so in the back of the stroller is a brake it's a foot brake, but I have to use my hand. <laughs> um, so, and you just like push it. Now I'm gonna put the brake back on for a second. Um, and then you can, I'm not gonna do it cause I'm not sure exactly how, and I don't wanna accidentally take off the hand if you look at it one day. Um, but you, um, and I will show you how, I, I know how to unfold and fold the jogger. You can adjust the handlebar so it can go lower or higher. However, the person who's pushing your child, you want to push. You can. I don't know how to do it, so I'm not going to break anything. Here's how you fold it. There are two like levers on the side, and so you just uh, press these down. You fold it up, 
and you know it just folds up like that and literally you just unfold it like that um so i'm gonna get in it for a second and i'm gonna tell you guys why i use it okay all right so let me move this pillow all the way back it is a hot summer day today so this is what i would look like hold on let me move my pillow my pillow's kind of okay so if we're going on a long walk I'm in the canopy, can anyone see me? No, so this is good. That is really good to keep the sun out of my face, especially because I have epilepsy and all that kind of stuff and I don't over sweat. Um, but like I said, I use the special tomato stroller. It helps so much on my back. It has been really comfortable. Um, the Adaptive Mall has great, amazing customer service. Like they have been amazing. Um, and honestly, like, it's pretty much between this and my wheelchair, they're both pretty darn comfortable. Um, it's just that you can do more things with this than you can the wheelchair, but they're both different. So, um, this stroller is actually very expensive, but they have it at a good price. And I use it for long distances, the zoo, the mall, going on walks. Um, because of my cerebral palsy, and with me being a little person, my body gets really, really tired very easily. And so it's just easier for me to like, in my wheelchair, I can go on rides, but I can't like at the mall, I can carry stuff for people that I really can't usually carry in the um, wheelchair because it's just harder that way. So in the stroller, everybody puts their bags on me and I'm just like, okay. So mom, if you want to briefly, 20, 30 seconds, what, do, what is it like pushing me in the stroller? Like how's it- Fun, from, from fun because we can go faster and you're comfortable you don't have to stop and rest you don't lose your balance your arms don't hurt from using your cane for long periods or the crutches because sometimes when we go to, yes your crutches because when we go to the mall sometimes we might be there three or four hours or you might be with your the mall with your friends three yeah, or four I hours have to like not, not go anymore. or we can go around the neighborhood and i used to only be able to go around the block once or twice and you're worn out now i could walk for four to six ten miles if i wanted to you could go to the park with us yeah and the so. is really good too. Like I said, when it's really hot, I can have a drink. I should have had my Chick-fil-A drink in this video, you guys. <laughs> but I can have my drink and just go under the canopy, drink it, come out. And so, yeah. Um, so make sure you, you know, measure your child. I'm a rare case. I know I'm an adult in a stroller. It works for us. And thank you, Special Tomato, for everything that you have done for my family and I. And we appreciate it very much. Yes, thank you, Special Tomato.